just uploading a new mix to SoundCloud for my boy Blake for his birthday. I was hoping it would be done already and then I could listen to it back on the way while I'm driving, but no such luck today. Um, it is 10 to 9 in the morning and we're going to Rogate. Uh, not been there for absolutely ages. Um, so I'm really excited. Looks like they've done quite a lot of work there as well. I uh, just need to grab the bike and some breakfast. Uh, and we're off. Oh, there she is. Isn't she cute? Oh no. It's the noise parade. Yeah, definitely getting out of here. Well, nearly here. Very excited. Apparently they've changed the parking setup as well, so I'm kind of looking for a different car park now. Um, I used to live about 20 minutes from here and ride here all the time. Before it was a proper bike, well it was a bike park, but um, they had like a committee that ran it and now it's sort of part of the, the B1KE stuff, so it's like a chain of bike parks if you will. Um, I think it's here. I hope. CCTV no parking. Ah, oh, there's loads of cars. Jesus. Good job I'm in a truck. So it's like a three minute, three or four minute walk now from the car park uh, to the trailhead. But this is sick. That's loads better than before. Going to the top, is it? Yeah. Oh man. And there was a horrible little double here, which is now. Oh mate. This is loads better. It's actually quite similar to the top of Tidworth. No, I've been here before, but I've not been here since all this had been done. That's the one with the step on, step off thing, yeah? Yeah, yeah. The, the, this, I think this section's got two or three fairly large sort of doubles, double gap sort of thing. But then when you get down to the bottom section, that's when it gets a bit crazy. <laughs> Save um, that for later. Yeah. Oh, this is awesome though. To the bottom. Although I wish I brought water now. Yeah. Because I thought I was, I thought I was in that bit. The, you know the race parking that's over. I thought I was yeah. there. I went down to the usual bit and the guy said Spun you around. Back up, back round, back down. I suppose you've got to come back up the hill to get back to your car. It's got yeah. Huh. Oh. Um you trained it as well. <laughs> yeah. This is one of the original race lines. What? One thing I do know. Oh, is it super dusty? Oh, this is different. Woo. Okay, that was slightly different. Seems like a fair bit may have changed. Uh, best bet will be to go down main line. Oh man, I properly miss this place. Oh my god. <laughs> okay. 
I thought they'd replace that jump. That's completely different. Okay. I mean, this is the same as... That's fucking way bigger than a lot of the ones at the bull track. And it's like a quarter of the height. I mean, I know they're going to throw you up. And that's the forward jump, but... I mean, that's long. Go back and hit that. Step on, step off, I think, in a minute. Just trying to figure out, okay. <laughs> Go on, kid. Yo! Nice, man. Last time I came here, it was so wet. You could barely get the speed for any of these. But, it's looking good. Some mellow, decent landing as well. Hmm. There's a lot of new features, and it looks like that DMR thing's got a landing now as well, which is sick because that was just a gas to flat, which is horrible. Is it still cut up in there then? Oh yeah, it's still fucking rooty at root face. Still got to pin it through there, that's cool. Some skinnies as well. Definitely have to give them a go. These jumps have been here forever. I kind of hoped that they'd bred some life back into them, to be fair. They've not really changed for God knows. As long as I've been coming here, and that's over 10 years. It's a shame. Well, uh, although they work, so maybe they don't need to be changed. sand pit this looks quick through here and you got outside two smaller drops or a bigger triple <clears throat> which looks all right depending on speed it's hard to tell exactly where that goes though. I'm guessing that goes into the two new doubles at the bottom. <sighs> Spotted a few different lines that time. I want to try.
So, we've done the pre-ride. And the re-ride. Now, it's time for free ride. Pretty sweet. I think I landed back wheel first, need to dip my nose in a bit more, but definitely hit that again. This is something I've wanted to hit for ages. Um, pretty much since it was built. Um, I've only been back once and it was really wet and I just didn't do it basically. Uh, but it's actually looking really sick. It doesn't look, you know sometimes when you see something for the first time and you're like, oh my God, that's massive. But it actually doesn't look that bad now. Uh, although it's one of those things that you just got to do it first time. Uh, because you can't really, once you're up there, you're not going to be able to get off. But it looks more than doable. It's just a bigger version of that other one. Definitely going to hit this. Dropping into Bottle Rocket. You got it. Go, go, go. Nice. This time, you fucking. Oh, sick.
spotted a skinny <laughs> oh that was scary I don't fancy that one <laughs> That was brilliant. Um, managed to get a couple of bits done that I really wanted to do for ages. Um, and I even went back and tried to link it up in one full run, but it was a little bit iffy. I could tell I was getting tired from all the push-ups and that, so it's a bit scrappy. Um, but so much fun. I can't believe it's been so long since I've been here. I was speaking to Sam, one of the guys as well, and that, that DMR trail that everyone knows is like Bren, Deeks, Ollie Wilkins and all that the s &M trail actually stands for Sam and Mike and that the concept of that trail is from like donkeys ago like before way before like DMR got involved um, and I actually helped build some well I say build all we actually did was dig out a giant tree stump um, which is still there on the hillside which is kind of funny um, I saw it today as I was pushing up or looking looking around um, so I was so impressed with how far Rogate's come like in the last I don't know eight years really like to go from being sort of it was unofficial then it was official then we had like um, a committee and stuff and now they've been taken out now they're working with bike um, and they've got so much going on like they've got some funding they can build what they want they do proper planning permission they've got their own scene there like it's so popular it's I'm buzzing to see it to be fair because like it's always been Sam's dream to run that place properly like I remember when he was working at crank uh, cycles and, and he, he, all he really wanted to do like he's definitely the best person to be running that place so you know only bigger and better things to come and hopefully it can run some races soon as well uh, they always put a fantastic race on it's always really popular like sells out within like two or three days Whoa. I thought someone was behind me then. sells out like you know straight away two or three hours sorry not two or three days and uh, I look forward to racing it again so hopefully we'll be able to smash out another Rogate World Cup Pro Gate and uh, I'm going to Mackey's now don't tell Ash. Hiya. 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 Yes, please. Okay. Should have come round this way, but I can quickly. How are you meant to know? There is a sign down there. No card, pay uh, card payment only. Twenty-five pound maximum spend. No milkshakes today. All right. Right. So up to in the high bin, please. Fucking hell. Also. Another thing, this is one for you Mountie, being an engineer, although I think you're more of a bridge engineer than an engineer engineer, or maybe diving engineer, but anyway, the seat buzzing thing is really starting to knock me off now, I've moved my seat all the way forward, but I don't, it's not really buzzing, but I don't like it that far forward, and I can't have it any higher, else it's going to tap my arse when I'm riding, but if I put my rear wheel in a longer setting, will that stop the buzz? Because if it's like at the end of a lever, surely it will travel more distance. So does that mean it will still buzz or will that stop it? I don't know. I need you to answer this before I take all of my rear triangle off to change the, uh, the dropouts to make my wheel face longer. Answers on a postcard, please. Bye, Felicia.